Looking to secure a long-term loan for your business? Understanding the approval process can significantly increase your chances. My name is Tim Shaw, Senior Underwriter with First Union Lending. Most long-term business loans, especially those over two years, depend heavily on analyzing yearly cash flows. This means lenders are keenly interested in your last two, three years of tax returns and financials. So what exactly do you need to have ready? At least two years of your most recent business tax returns, the current year-to-date financials, which includes your profit and loss statement and a balance sheet. A debt sheet detailing all existing debts with their balances and monthly payments. Now let's dive deeper. When underwriters scan your documents, here is what they will focus on. Number one, most recent business tax returns are crucial. Revenue and gross sales. You want this number to grow year after year. If it is declining, it could be a red flag, but don't panic. Pro tip, if your revenue has dipped, be prepared to explain why and how you're strategizing to increase your sales. Next, we have the ordinary business income or loss. Being in the positive, fantastic. But if it's negative, your application could be a risk. Pro tip, try adding back the officer's salary and amortization. If this switches losses to positive, you might still be in the game. If not, consider reducing expenses and reapply once you're back in black. Lastly, your year-to-date financials. If you're pacing well and poised to surpass last year's numbers, great. If not, be ready to explain how you're addressing shortfalls. Remember, lenders appreciate growth. Present your business proactively with clarity and transparency and you'll be on the path to securing that long-term loan. In conclusion, if you have losses on your taxes or revenue declined, no worries. There are other often better shorter-term financing options available for you including lines of credit and 12 to 24 months loans. Please visit our website and contact our professionals First Union Lending to learn more information.